For the Daily Commercial News in 90, I'm Lori Farfaglia. Niagara Bottling Company has given the gift of play to Groveland Elementary School. The California-based bottling company has a facility in Groveland. Niagara donated over $106,000 to make the new playground at Groveland Elementary School a reality. Due to the recent rise in heroin overdoses in Lake County, Sheriff Peyton Grinnell recently made a public statement in a video that's gone viral. In the video, Sheriff Grinnell addresses one of the main sources of the problem, heroin dealers themselves. Sheriff Grinnell says he wants to make citizens of Lake County know that he's aware of the serious problem and plans to solve it. Eustis Heights Elementary School and Triangle Elementary School have installed laundry facilities to help families in need. The program allows students to drop off dirty laundry in the office and volunteers wash and fold the students' clothes and have it ready for pickup in the afternoon. Lake Express, Lake County's fixed route public transit service, is offering 160 special stops throughout Leesburg, Fruitland Park, the Villages, Mount Dora, Eustis, and Tavares during the 21st annual Leesburg Bike Fest. The event is April 28th through the 30th in downtown Leesburg. Fares are a dollar each way or three dollars for an unlimited day pass. A local clown club has donated to the Carver Middle School Robotics Team Travel Fund. The robotics team is preparing to head to the World's Competition in Kentucky later this month. The clowns from the Holiday Travel Clown Club donated $300 to help the group make the trip. For more local news, visit dailycommercial.com. That's this week's Daily Commercial News in 90 on LSTV. I'm Lori Farfaglia.